Uh, we are very, very honored to have been given a very private and exclusive tour of the library of Professor Fuad Sezgin by uh, his student, uh, who is a PhD candidate, Usman Sinar. He has given us a very exhaustive tour. I'm going to summarize some of the knowledge that he has uh, given us. If you don't know who Professor Fuad Sezgin is, you should. Professor Fuad Sezgin, I would say, is the prize of Turkey, uh, intellectual prize. He has edited more than figure this out, 1,600 books. Take a look at the books that Fuad Sezgin has edited. This is a section of his library. The books are edited by him, and they are all editions and articles about the intellectual figures of our ummah. The figures that span all of the fields, whether it's tafsir or hadith, whether it is uh, geography, whether it is astronomy, whether it is physics. And of course, uh, Dr. Faiz Sezgin's speciality was Islam and science and the history of science. And he passed away recently at the age of 94, 94 having lived half of his life in Turkey and half of his life in Germany. Mostly in Germany. Mostly in Germany. Yeah. And he is buried uh, outside of this library in the famous Kulhana. Uh, uh, garden which is connected to the Hagia Sophia and the Topkapi uh, Museum. I wanted to show you some examples here. And by the way, these books span multiple languages. Arabic, English, Latin, German, French, have I left anything out? Dutch. You have multiple languages and a lifetime of effort of every single field. So for example, let's look at uh, uh, so Al-Makhrizi, the famous geographer Al-Makhrizi, okay? al geography Al-Islamiyya, okay? Al-Mujadal al Mi'atin wal khamsun volume 250. This is just about one field of science, this entire section over here. Islamic Geography, volume 250. This is al uh, Makhrizi, the famous uh, geographer, and his uh, professor Sezgin edited uh, and published books from all different fields. So we have over here, for example, Dhikru uh, Madinati Udfu. Okay, so where is Madinat Udfu? I have no idea. But uh, Idrisi talks about it, Makrizi talks about it, and Professor Fuad Sezgin has published this book. So all of these over here. For example, okay. uh, let me mention my uh, master thesis oh, okay. uh, subject, which is this is Al Maktisi Ahsan al Taqasi. This is one of the classics definitely, of Islamic geography. Because Al Maktisi is the first man to systemize uh, the all geography discipline in the Islamic world. That's why he has uh, traveled all Islamic countries he from, was a from, from as well. Morocco, yes. Andalusia mm -hmm. to uh, Central Asia. And mm -hmm. also he traveled, he has written his book during the journey on the camel by writing and by noting mm -hmm. what he uh, he observed mm -hmm. in, in an Islamic society. And he traveled Thousand from Andalus years. all the way to China. Uh, yes, yeah, till right? the Central yes. Asia. Yes. He, of course, separated all Islamic mm -hmm. countries region by region, the mm -hmm. best book in its uh, Eng translation into English, the best division for knowledge of the regions. Ahsan mm al-Taqasim fi ma'rifat al And he divided the world into various aqalim. Yeah, 14 regions. Yes. He divided the and all this Islamic is real. one of the books that... Yeah, Professor Sezgin has chosen best uh, manuscript. edition critic, best mm -hmm. uh, manuscript edition critics. For example, this one uh, edited by the uh, Hoya, it is a Dutch uh, yes, editor, Dutch person, yes. and Professor Seski cho has chosen mm -hmm. its uh, edition and mm -hmm. also added here and published this book. And on the other hand, of course, this book with all edition critic mm -hmm. texts includes some important articles hundred mm. years ago, which was written by some interesting French and English so Orientalists about uh, al maqdisi yes. some in other name they say, they al pronounce al muqaddisi al maqdisi same yeah. writing, there's no difference. So some of the books Professor Sezgin uh, took from others, and he put uh, basically, uh, this is a famous uh, Dutch Orientalist, and others he took the original manuscript. Let me show you an example of an original manuscript. He would simply take yeah. the manuscript. Yeah. And, and this is Al Idrisi's, another famous geographer. And he would take the original manuscript and allow it just print it. Yeah. This is a facsimile copy of Idrisi's famous book. And I forgot the name now because we're on video, otherwise, of course, everybody knows the name. Uh, the name of Idrisi's book is 
Uns al-Mahj wa Raud al-Faraj, Ta'lif al-Idrisi, died 560. This is an unpublished book when Professor Fa'as has discovered the manuscript. Yeah. So what did he do? He took the manuscript and he made it accessible to all of the specialists. So this is a lifetime of work. Actually, to be honest, this is not a lifetime of an average person. I myself was shocked to hear that he did 1,600. I had to confirm with us <laughs> many repeat. times, like, are you sure 1,600? Yes, 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 because yes. I was thinking maybe 40, 50 volumes, because I had seen a few of these, you know, in my, you know, studies, you know, because obviously, you know, my field is not Islam and science. This is primarily Islam and science, right? And I had seen a number of these, and I'm very impressed at Professor Asazgin, but I find out today it's 1,600, and this is but one aspect, of course, Professor Fa'as Sazgin is primarily known for his famous book. Notable uh, work is a Geschichte des Arabischen Schrifttums. Is a known as GAS, it's summarized GAS, GAS versus GAS. Maybe we can translate And it, it is 17 volumes, correct? 17 volumes. 17 he passed volumes. away when he uh, started the 18 volumes. Uh, he passed away in the 18th volume. And this book is basically a biographical summary along a background of, of who? Of every intellectual thinkers, thinkers, philosophers, scientists of the first 400, 500 years of Islam. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and, and for his famous book. Notable uh, work is a Geschichte des Arabischen Schriftums. Is a, known as GAS, it's summarized GAS, GAS versus GAS. Maybe we can trust And it, it is 17 English. volumes, correct? 17 volumes. 17 he passed volumes. away when he uh, started the 18 volumes. He uh, passed away in the 18th volume. And this book is basically a biographical summary along a background of who? Of every intellectual thinkers, thinkers philosophers, scientists of the first 400, 500 years of Islam. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, and what he's done is... From, from 8th century, no, from uh, 6th century, Sixth century to uh, 10th century. To 10th century. So the, the first, first 400 years of Islam. Classic period. Yes. Classic and what period. he's done is he's summarized the contributions of uh, those ulama in all the fields and also where their manuscripts are found, which is something that hardly anybody has done. And again, this is done by the same person who did the 1,600 volumes. This is another uh, book of his, which again made him world famous. So bottom line, Professor Fuad Sezgin, and I, by the way, I studied him and heard about him when I was in Jama Islami in Medina and when I was at Yale. Like right. this is a person who is respected across the globe yeah. and known in all disciplines. My ulama and mashayikh would quote the works of Fuad Sezgin and my professors at Yale are quoting the works of Fuad Sezgin. He transcended any one civilization. He spoke 27 languages, unbelievable. And I did not have the honor of meeting him, but we met one of his students who summarized for us much of his contribution. So once again, I'd like to thank soon to be Professor Usman, he's doing his PhD, but soon to be Professor Usman, inshallah, we hope. You're going to be professor soon, inshallah. I hope so, but inshallah. I'm trying to do my best not to be professor because uh, the science always needs sacrificing. So <laughs> inshallah. that's why I really. But this is this is a part of the legacies of pressure. Professor Fuad Sezgin. We ask Allah Azza wa Jal to bless and inshallah. forgive him and grant him jannah, inshallah. Salam alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. فلكك المشحول يا من أحال النار حول خليله روحا وريحانا بطولك كون